Hi there. I posted a video of my first affordable bike and received many comments ranging from uh, what's the price to what's the weight. And guess what? I brought a weighing machine to check it out. But uh, before we answer those questions, let's go through some of the comments. Before I start going through the comments, um, probably I should put some context into this. So basically I was searching for a cheap foldable bike. Um, the cheapest that I could find that has 7 speed and even a disc brake. Um, so before this bicycle, the last one I had was probably in my teenage years. Teenage years, I was still a teenager. And during those days, they, that, 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 there was already um, uh, gear shifters, Shimano gear shifters. But at that time, there weren't any disc brakes. So this, uh, this is uh, one of the things that wowed me. Wow, disc brakes, it feels like a car or a motorcycle with a very very uh, advanced technology so to speak so so I was searching for something uh, affordable bike um, that has gear shifter as well as disc brakes at the lowest price that I could find and so um, that's how this the, the previous video came about and I titled it cheap 20 inch foldable bike so as soon as I shared the video uh, I got a lot, a lot of comments and um, so I'm going to go through the comments right now. Alright, so this uh, the first comment that I got was cheapest, question mark, cheapest, yet your rear wheel is spinning longer than my $389 cheap Fody. I'm not too sure what he's trying to mean, whether um, that this bike is, is good because the rear wheel can spin longer than his $389 cheap Fody. He, he considered $389 as a cheap. Okay, the next comment um, says that uh, it's a well-edited video of a product, short and clear to the detail. Oh, well, thank you. Thank you for saying that. And uh, the next comment, how much? Yeah, this, this person wants to know what's the price. And the same person says, uh, where did you buy it? Where you bought? Um, next person says, yes, yes, I also want to know the dollar dollar sign and where to buy. Okay, I will review that at the um, end of the video. Okay, the next comment, how much and where you buy? Okay, the next one, my daughter uses this. It's, this person mentioned the price, but I'm not going to say it now. And, and it's good, the person says. Um, I have this for sale if anyone wants. Okay, so yeah, you might want to check it out with this person. Okay, um, next comment. You don't really need water. Okay, I also mentioned in the post that um, I haven't got the uh, water bottle holder as well as the water bottle. As you can see on the bike frame, it doesn't have the water bottle holder. So I'm waiting for those to arrive in the mail. And um, so I said I'm not going to ride long distance, I'm not going to ride on the PCN um, before I got those. And this person commented that you don't really need water bottle along PCN, especially in the east. Many um, there are many water fountains, so start paddling. <laughs> in fact, I have actually already start paddling this bike to uh, to nearby coffee shops to buy lunch, but I haven't really uh, done a long distance yet. So, well, until I got those uh, accessories, I will only do the short distance. Okay. Okay, next comment. Uh -huh. This one is um, right. It says he says that uh, good luck to your to your leg. You can train with this. Okay, the next one. I hope you have uh, better luck with this. I bought the exact same one and the rear hub ball bearing tree uh, was uh, disintegrated among a range of other problems in less than two months. Well, uh, I shall see whether this bicycle will last me. Of course, I'm hoping that it will last longer than two months. So we shall see how it goes. Um, the next comment says, uh, it, look, it, it's, uh, it looks simple, decent and lightweight. Okay, next comment, at least 14 kilograms. Probably good for short, short distance commuting and flat terrain. And then a comment following that says that um, 17 to 19 kg that range, cost full suspension. But 
I don't I, I don't think there are, there are any suspensions on it unless uh, this person is referring to something that I'm not aware of because I'm not a bicycle expert. So probably um, uh, the person can elaborate. Yeah, suspension. What he means. And yeah, another person asks, "What's the damage?" Yeah, I think he's referring to the price. Next comment: price? Question mark. The next comment: For a full bike, anything more than ten kg is not lightweight. Okay, more than ten kg is not lightweight. Okay, and the next comment actually mentioned the price increase over time, right? With the uh, different values. I will not reveal that okay at this moment and then for the follow-up comment to that comment says that is this better than Java Zero both seven speed Java Zero V2 cost about 338 bro a uh, 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 comment that follows up says bro seriously need to go test ride it but the Java Zero V2 has better finishing. The price is cheap, but not sure about quality. Yeah, I agree with this comment that you have to test it out, ride it, right? Uh, buy something. I mean, look for something within your budget, and then test ride it, check it out to see how it suits you. Right. Next comment. Nope. Definitely not the cheapest. I believe this person has done even more research than me much more research than me that uh, he knows that this is not the cheapest that uh, you could find. Okay, next comment. Mm, buy cheap, get cheap junk. Ah. Nice, next comment. Nice effort in making the video, but definitely not what I would invest in for a foldy, right? So this, is, this person uh, definitely is a more intermediate advance. Um, um, cycling enthusiasts, uh, folding by enthusiasts to want to invest more in a foldy. Right, next comment, change the tires to something slicker and lighter and the bike would make a decent PCN machine. Wow, this commenter um, likes his, her bike, yeah, it's a lady, likes her bike to look good, slick and light, of course and to perform as a decent machine okay that's all of the comments let's check out the weight and i will tell you what's the price okay i have the weighing scale here and i'm going to put the bike on the weighing scale and try to balance it with the handles as uh, much as i can and Let's take a look what the weight is. And so, there you have it. Alright, so as for the price, um, I will put a link in the description and by the way I'm not affiliated with the seller right I'm just a, a regular customer who bought this bike and uh, making this video and uh, since so many people want to know where to buy it and what's the price I'll put a, the link in the description you can check out the price because the price may change like some other user uh, I mean there's a commenter earlier which I mentioned um, has noticed that the price has risen over time yep so that's about it so I hope you um, enjoyed the video and uh, if you could give me a subscribe a like that would be awesome All right thank you again see you next time